Well folks, he's the nine. Has found himself down at the volley. Absolutely glorious day. Third of July, the sun's out, must be in the seventies. I've already walked around the hillist. That's my fitness for today. Look at the park, look at the fantastic Nick this person. They go on they go on about Wembley, Hamden, places like that. I've seen it before in one of my videos. It doesn't get any better than this. Just to let you know, this park has been kept in this nick for 50 odd years by Davy Clark. Davy Clark's to be seen all weathers on his tractor. Keeping this park in the nick it is. Look at it. Yeah, close up of that grass. Absolutely fantastic nick. Davy Clark, take a bow. You've done a credit to Armadale for many years. Today's story from the volley is a recent one, but it's an ongoing one. Nobody quite own, knows who owns the volley. I'm not sure who owns it. Is it the bank? Somebody else? Don't know. But one thing is for sure, Scott Mid. We been trying to buy it for the last two or three years. Put a new store in. And the historians amongst us, or the traditionalists I should say, we don't want that. We don't want a Scott Mid here. There's one up there, like the blue building. That's Scott Mid. Just stay where you are. Traditionalists want the volley to stay here home of Armadale Thistle Football Club. That's the way it should be. In fact, I was in George O'Coyer's shop one day, as I do, and this chap comes in, the clipboard, yellow jacket. In fact, it wasn't a yellow jacket guy, it was a suit guy. Suit, clipboard, official. Comes into Giorgio, says, Giorgio, Mr. Coyer, we're in here canvassing for support for Scott Mid to take over a volley. What do you think? George was a bit non-committal on the subject. The chap decided to ask me. This is well, mate. Put it this way: when Scott Mid come in, their bulldozers will be chained to the front gate. They have to either dig round about me or take me off it. The guy just looked at me. I says, "Mate, I was a captain at Armadale. I'm not kidding you on. You come with the bulldozers, I'll be chained up, mate. Be ready for that." The guy turned on his heels. Left the shop, not knowing if I was joking or not. <laughs> Hope it doesn't come to that, folks, because one day a big haste of nine be chained to that gate there. The volley has got to stay the home of Armadale Thistle. Scott Mid, go somewhere else. There's a shed. The old boys, we are here.